If you're a fan of the Mama June franchise, you're familiar with the ups and downs of reality TV celebrity. What you may not know is how Lauren Pumpkin Efred, one of the main characters, manages to balance financial difficulties and high-profile purchases. Pumpkin, for example, recently proudly displayed her husband Joshua, Josh Efred's new Ram truck on TikTok, and not long ago she openly solicited her fans for financial assistance. Josh, a mechanic who has worked with companies such as Fun Factory and Southern RV, is a constant fixture on the show, Stars Offline. They portray daily problems and accomplishments magnified by the magnifying glass of reality television. But once the cameras stop rolling, how real are these challenges? Lauren, Pumpkin Efred, took to TikTok Live earlier this year to vent about her financial problems. The reality actress admitted to having a tight budget and even revealed her PayPal, Venmo, and Cash App identities with any willing supporters. Surprisingly, she was able to raise $1,000 by the end of the session. Pumpkin's financial plea extended beyond cash. She also welcomed donations of diapers and formula for her children. Lauren Pumpkin Efford's financial troubles, on the other hand, are difficult to reconcile with her more expensive spending. She just posted a video showing off Josh's new truck, which is worth around $37,905, according to Ram's official website. Fans are left with unanswered questions as a result of these contradictory visuals. Furthermore, let us not forget that the Mama June show is not a low-budget project. Lauren's mother, June Shannon, reportedly earns a stunning $25,000 per month from her WeTV contract and other advertising arrangements, The Sun. While Pumpkin's specific earnings have not been publicized, it is safe to infer that her earnings from the show are substantial. Pumpkin has started offering parenting tips for $15, each in an effort to diversify her revenue streams. Not only that, but on her fanbase account, she actively encourages other digital experiences such as personalized video greetings and Instagram followback. These businesses demonstrate an enterprising drive far apart from the financial constraints she mentions. So, what is the current state of affairs? With all of these conflicting signs, determining the exact depth of Pumpkin's financial condition becomes increasingly difficult. And, as fans, we're all involuntarily strapped in. Is it about the gloss and splendor of, is it about new vehicles and possible reality TV salary, or is it about the genuine struggle that comes with being responsible for a family and living a life that is constantly scrutinized?